and environmentalists in Nigeria have expressed concern over the frequent use of fossil fuel in local communities, noting that the government should encourage the use of clean energy. Now, according to the United Nations, about 40 million Nigerians are using fossil fuel, such as charcoal, firewood, and other cheap means due to the high cost of gas. Now, while raising concern over the environmental challenges, activists also urge the authorities to support the vulnerable. Here's more details of that in this report. Rabi Musa is preparing lunch for her family in the outskirts of Abuja. She uses firewood to cook because it's affordable and burns easily. Cooking with firewood is fast, easier and way cheaper for me. Gas is too expensive. I cannot afford it. Many poor Nigerians living in rural communities like Rabi use firewood and charcoal because other cleaner cooking fuels like gas are costly. According to the UN, about 40 million Nigerians use charcoal and fuel wood. It is concerned about the dangerous fumes users inhale when using these fuels, as well as the decline in the quality of soil that is used for agricultural purposes, among other negative effects. The United Nations says that close to 4 million people die prematurely every year from illnesses linked to household air pollution. This, it says, is caused by the use of stoves and solid fuels like charcoal and firewood for cooking. Environmentalists warn that cutting down of trees to make charcoal and fuel would adversely affect people and the environment. The fertility of the soil from which we grow food depends on other plants also because they give back to the ground as much as they take. And if we continue like this, we are going to be eating too many chemical or processed food or GMOs. Right? And we already know the long-term effects of it. So our awareness, our ability to have quality air, ability to have quality food, ability to have, you know, it, 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 it's all going to be inter um, disturbed so long with fall trees. There are other alternatives for fuel. The United Nations says if people don't act quickly, exposure to air pollution beyond safe guidelines will increase by 50% within the decade. Conservationists say Nigeria's government needs to protect the environment by providing cheaper alternatives to cooking fuels and policies that will discourage illegal tree felling. If every state has a landmass where there is a replacement of trees, or these trees are cut in a way that you don't cut it like all the way down, you fall branches, or in those days people just use broken branch, branches for wood, firewood, right? So I think we need to work our way around it so that we don't lose the trees completely. In March last year, Nigeria announced that gas will be a major energy source for electricity and for cooking between 2021 and 2030. And the government says it is working to make available about 10 million cylinders across the country at affordable prices to encourage more people to use gas for cooking. But for now, many Nigerians like Rabi argue that firewood remains the cheaper option.